Welcome back guys to a new video, this is Rebuilds NA. Um, today we're going to be starting a new project. Got this wee project off a damaged salvage auction. As you see it's a 2009 Coyote 1.2 Patrol. Now, so far as you can see the primary damage is obviously your headlight, your bumper and your wing. Now obviously from getting this car you can see the wing's cracked. So we're going to, need, we're going to replace that wing, replace the headlight and replace that bumper. But other than that she's a clean car. Now the things we're going to be doing, we're going to be like painting these wee handles, I'll not be painting them. My friend's going to paint them, he's going to paint them silver with satin lacquer. Just to tidy her up because obviously this car is clean enough wee motor. We've just came, we had a wee look at this car yesterday, we've came around here and we've noticed wee things that maybe we didn't see in the auction photos. So, like that wee bumper has kept it, we did notice that, we weren't too really worried about that. But, you know the wee, the wee clips are broken the bracket so maybe they might actually hold here and here, but we'll have to find out. Even the bumpers broke there, so we'll have to try to get that bumper secured in there nice. And another thing we did notice, that we're definitely going to do, if you look, I don't know if you can see it in the camera, if you look at the, ah oh yeah you can. I don't know if it's a bad repair or if it's been on fire, but it just looks all blistered and stuff. So we're going to paint that tailgate, we're going to try and get a black front bumper, a black wing and a headlight. So the only matter is painting this tailgate here obviously. Now there's another thing we noticed, I don't know if any of you guys would have any idea on why, I don't know if she's open, yeah she's open, but basically when we, when we got her, none of the seatbelts are retracting, no none of them's coming out, they're all as hard as the road you know, I have no clue why, now my brother thinks they're locked and we might need to replace all the belts, I'm hoping we don't, because obviously that's Cutting into our budget a wee bit. As you can see, the inside of the car is a wee bit dirty. So we're gonna give that a clean. So what you're wondering is what we're gonna do in this video today. Basically, what we're gonna do, we're gonna bring this car up and round it with garages. I'm gonna do a wee time lapse of me washing it. Just cleaning her out and stuff and giving her a wee quick hoover on the inside. Just basically cleaning her up and seeing what the main damage is, because that's one thing they don't do in my really videos, they don't, any new car I get it, just use it, fire on, fix them, but no, this video we're going to do it right, we're going to wash her and see what we're working with, because we're going to buff this whole car, we need to make sure we can buff it, you know, like these wee scores now, we need to tidy her all up, so anyway guys, we're going to bring this up round to you guys and get cracking on. So you have it guys, have the car all washed, wheels actually come out pretty good, the other side's actually a wee bit sorry so I might just paint the wheels, um, I'm going to tell you it's washed but really not because it's still stinking in my slow spaces but who cares, we're going to see if this hair buff out in the quarter on that bumper, I might see if I can get a new bumper for the back of her because there's a lack of wee scores on it, I might just paint it, well, I might just get a quarter of a litre and paint that tailgate and paint that bumper, just to have it right. Um, Oh, not there, it's actually a pretty clean week yard, it's only marks are sort of see. Uh, the same wee wheels are a wee bit scuffy, so I might just blow them four wheels in, might as well, and get them handles painted. It's all about small things, tidy a car up. So basically what we're going to do now, pull the front over into the garage. We're going to 
polish from Bon Bra. And we're gonna pull this light out. I might just leave the wing on for now, but we'll pull this off and see how it is in behind it and stuff. Hopefully it's not too bad and we don't have to spend any more money. So I'm gonna actually pull her back a wee bit because the lighting's actually not too good here and we'll get cracking. So you have it guys, have the headlight and all out. I'm not picking a wing off, I'm just going to leave it on for now until we get the new wing. Um, there's surely one other broken bit of C, bar taking that off. Obviously it's cross members, we're going to probably need one of them. Um, we're going to need an intercooler. Intercooler smashed all along the top there. I'm not even going to try and fix it, I'm just getting a new one. And other than that, there's actually not that much damage really on her. Front panel's all in good shape. Happy days, because don't want to spend too much money on it to be honest. Just really annoyed about that intercooler, but hey, sometimes you just had a bad, don't you? Like, so that bumper comes off real easy enough. If anyone knows, know, there's like four or three 10 miles, like four 10 miles along the top and two buttons underneath. There's like two 25 torques each side and two across the middle, and two 10 mils up this way to hold around that wing. And your headlight just comes out with a 10 mil up here and a 10 mil down here and there's another 10 mil here I think yeah here and it just comes off real easy well mine fell out because it was smashed so anyway guys there you have it that's an RV video done and if you like it make sure you like comment subscribe drop down in the comments if you know anything about them seatbelts why they're stuck um, I'm just hoping I don't have to replace them all anyway guys this is Rebuilds NA out